Thank you for joining us tonight, uh, ladies singles, and I don't think there is any surprise at who's in it, Johnny Jepp. Well, it comes down to the old school with uh, Stacey Thicket and Sue Thicket. Their name is etched in those boards more times than I can um, actually... It's, make, it's making my hand sore. <laughs> just, just thinking about it, how many times their name has been etched into that uh, singles board, and of course, recent winners of the ladies' double stone. Yes, that's right. Uh, you know, teammates two weeks ago, John, foes this week. They are thickets that just go straight out the window, Dane. That does. Um, I can't see any problem there. I don't think uh, that Mum will be getting any favours, and I'm damn sure the daughter won't. No, highly, highly competitive family, the Thickets. Uh, I'm leaning towards Stacey. I think she's got a more complete game than Sue, but uh, things can happen in the singles finals, John. Well, I noticed uh, in the lead-up games there, um, Stacey was going short and was bowling quite well, but then in that latter game, in this last semi-final, I noticed Sue bowling short, and she was actually getting it on the, on the mama, so... Um, yeah, y if you were doing a book, Stacey would be a slight favourite for the reasons you outlined there. She is probably just a tad more complete, but oh, just watching that last game, I think Sue will match it bowl for bowl. Yeah, interesting contest we have for you tonight. Uh, this will be a cracker, no regards. Uh, COVID's probably restricted our numbers a little bit during the whole championships, John. Uh, but I think the, the proper two personnel in the final is correct tonight. I think uh, you couldn't possibly ask for a better outcome, and this will be a cracker. Oh, yes, without a doubt. There are some players that I would have loved to have included, but like you say, uh, with our restrictions and COVID and uh, what have you, it has come down to these two players, and no one can um, dispute their, their ability. Um, they were uh, virtually... Um, a grade above everything they played today without being disrespectful to any of the players. Um, you're right, this is the right final and uh, we will get the rightful winner out of this because uh, these are two of the best. No, I'm really looking forward to it. This is going to be a cracker of a game. I can't wait to get involved and we are going to bring it to you right here and this is fantastic. Uh, just before we mention, we still have two championships left. Uh, we do are running a big promotion with Broken Hill Limousine, Johnny Jepp. Uh, win, a, win a ride in a limo for basically rocking up and play. So Excellent. if you still want to get a ticket, we have the men's singles next week. We have the mixed doubles the week after. If you haven't got a partner, find one and just get your name in the draw. It'll be drawn after the mixed doubles final. We'll have Randall Blake here, the owner of Broken Hill Limousine. He'll be drawing the name out of the hat. So if you want a chance to win it, get down here. What a fantastic promotion, Dane. Can't wait. Um, I'm getting involved. I, uh, I can't see why anyone else who has a played bocce or wants to play come down here uh, to the best kept secret in Broken Hill, which is the uh, Napradak Club. What a great promotion, Dane. Yeah, fantastic. We'll be right back now with the women's singles final, Susan Thicket versus her daughter, Stacey Thicket. Can't wait. Righto, we're about to start the women's singles final for 2021. 
A uh, little bit of confusion here from the coin toss, John. Well, we have a um, a ref that uh, I don't know if he, he's not actually on the register. I don't even think he's a paid member of the referee fraternity. So pretty disappointing that we can't get someone a bit better than Darren Dingo Smith. But yeah. times are tough. I am utilising a couple of good umpires here and me and you commentating and Blake Thicket and Dave Edgecombe on the cameras. Uh, and I've left Bones out of it because I want him to rotate the commentary box. Leaves us pretty short, doesn't it? it unfortunately, uh, Dingo is the next in line. And as an umpire, he's uh, making a very good drink at. Always good for a couple of dollars over the bar, Dingo. Oh, marvellous. But I think he, as he, as he conned Bones into doing it, what was he? Um, he doesn't... Is he doing it? Oh, no, he's giving us the bird. And he has, he has taken our spare, he has taken our spare commentator. And that's fine. That's, that's fine. All, that's fine. We'll, and we'll probably, have to deal with that. Yeah, I, well, I, I wouldn't like to see him at a measure and face plant the court. So, maybe a good thing. Yeah, probably right, John. Uh, Bones has done a couple of days, a uh, couple of umpiring jobs today, and he's done fantastic. Yeah, oh, one and of I, the most underrated umpires in I, the club. I've always said that about him. I said you should look at umpiring full time. Well, I can't see him doing anything else better than what he does when he umpires. Yeah. He's just so... He, he concentrates. That's a big thing. And now Sue Thicket has graced her with her presence. Here she comes. Oh, princess. Baby giraffe, as you called her. The baby giraffe was in full flight in all of her games today. She never gave anyone a look in. Probably the last game was a little bit of a scare, but well. she prevailed. Similar to Stacey's approach to today, I don't think she had too many troubles getting through her qualifying stages, John. So it is set for a marvellous game between and these two stalwarts. And we are just waiting on Bones. He is just going to the bar to freshen himself uh, another nice and cold beverage. Which is um, unlike him to put... Uh, a drink before the game, but he's back. He's back. Oh, he's dropped the coin. And he's dropped the coin. Oh, what a start. This is not a great start from the umpire. Oh, God. We oh, just wrapped him is, up. This is awful. I the, hope this doesn't affect him, John. Well, we just wrapped him up, and what's he do? Yeah. Cardinal yeah. Sin dropping the coin before the toss. I mean, you can toss a coin so many times, John, and then one time you you stuff it up. Well, not, not when there's a big final. Oh, one. I know. The pressure gets to the umpires as much as it does to the players these days, uh, Jonathan. Well, we may have to rethink his status as one of the best umpires. Anyway, we're away. And so straight down to the back. What we call the Stacey shot area. <laughs> as Bones just gives me a clip on the ear roll as he walks past, he must have heard everything I said. I didn't think we were on loudspeaker. Anyway... <laughs> Game underway, not a great bowl from Sue. No, yeah, didn't really use the court to its full advantage there. Stacey looking a little bit, maybe a bit soft, but it might turn in. No, it didn't. Two ordinary bowls to start, a little bit of nerves from this uh, final game. Oh, and the wick. Oh, yes. And Susie says that was very nasty. What would we call that dirty botchy? Dirty, but it was dirty botchy. It was a good shot. And Sue's going offens uh, offensive here. She got the corner. Yes, excellent ball. Just got the corner. Just got the shot ball. And she is rewarded. Well, just judging on these first couple of ends, John, there is no love lost here. They are out to beat each other. Oh, there is no doubt. We uh, covered that in the preview. Every day of the week, they want their name back up on that board. Not mum, not daughter. To be the best, you've got to beat the best, John. Well, that's what we've got here this evening, Dane. Aaron Blake under the pump early. 
This is too uh, red, I believe. Oh, I think I'd strongly agree with that. And in a usual uh, defensive manner, Sue Thicket has thrown off. Yeah, touched off there from Sue. She really wanted it early, I think. But I think it's safe to say that'd be two, I think, John. No, it's two. But that looked like a yeah. an easy three if you wanted to have a crack at it. But yeah. Uh, uh, superstar umpire Aaron Blake he had a look at it for a while but finally realised that the right decision was two. Yes, his mannerisms are getting a bit too casual for mine. Yeah. Um, the toss of the coin is also a downturn in his yeah. uh, grading. But yeah. uh, we'll let him uh, progress through this. That's only the first end. I uh, hope he can lift his game. Yeah, he's definitely got some work to do, I'll tell a you that. Of, a lot of work in mind, for mine, Dane. A yeah. lot of work. This is a lot more comfortable than Sue here, I think. A little bit early off the wall. I think this would be a good one, John. A little bit heavy. Can get a kick from here. Oh, and she's she got did. a nasty wick. The wicker queen got a nasty wick. And Stacey correcting. Oh, she'll, she'll pounce on this. I can't see her not pouncing on it. Oh, yes. Just caught the corner and oh. made her pay. Come out so beautiful then. Just that little touch on the corner fanned out beautifully. Nice target for Sue. I can see you coming off this corner and yeah. taking the white or the black. This is a good shot. Yes. Yeah. Hit the nail on the head there, John. Every day of the week. Very good shot from a former champion in Sue Thicket. Stacey, not to be outdone, though. I think she's going to try and emulate the exact same shot, and I think she has. Oh! Ooh. Hang on. That is very close, Dane. That hit Buzz's footprint. There might be a couple of remnants of Buzz down there. You're right, John. Mm. Davo hasn't had a chance to come up since the uh, great doubles match. And Kerry has left what we what they used to call the carbon footprint, but it's uh, what we call the Kerry footprint. <laughs> yes, no, I think Davo went up to Wilcannia well, to spend a couple of nights on the Darling uh, mm. soon after the uh, men's doubles was completed. Still, la still laughing at the uh, game, I believe. Yes, yeah, he would be. And, and look at this. Look at this. This is atrocious. Why, why is he... What is he doing? He looks like he's losing all hope in his ability to umpire. But, uh, he, he's oh, not I crying, is he? Is he crying? No, I, I'm not sure. <laughs> <laughs> what, what, what was that call, Dane? Did you... I, I'm not sure. He's I, called it black. He uh, must have. Yes. I think he's called it black. Uh, what is it? Shot for shot. I think it's black. Yeah, from here I think it's black. But mm. And it should oh, still be black. Now, yes. this will be interesting. What happens here? No, it is shot for shot. So it, he's called that dead square. Okay, that might be one black. That was her last ball. So I believe that is one black. God, that looks damn close from there. But I think he's called it the casual umpire. Hand on hip. Little Mullet flowing like river water. Have a look at it. <laughs> well, it's not clear. It's a fucking dirty brown colour. <laughs> he does need a haircut. Yes, yeah. he, he is looking forward to it. Uh, Casey Jansen, one of our close friends, has the rights to shave it off. Sue is still questioning that call. Victor will never be dead. No, no, that's right. You can only say what the umpire says, John. Oh, well, he did measure it, so... Yes. Yeah, here we go. This is where I think Stacey will open the game up. Well, I tend to agree because she did bowl well in the games that she did this. But I, like I said, Sue wasn't far behind when she was bowling in these short ends. You're right. I think Stacey would be a bit more consistent at this uh, end, as in what we call a short end. It's a nice line. Very heavy. Yeah, just Brad snuck Brooks, through. number 21's kicked a goal. And uh, she has got a look of disdain after that effort. Still, she's still going to persist with that shot. Yeah, and now... It's, it's a pretty good effort. But it's a great really, shot. Yeah, it's a great is. shot, John. We know what, we sh what, what she should have been doing, don't yes. we? Yeah, should have, should have had a bit of aggression there, Sue. She's That's not a, a bad hitter. First ball, the baby giraffe should have come into play. 
Yeah, she's under the pump now, John. Oh, well, now she's got a. Oh, and this is a, totally back to front. And she's done it. She's got and away she's with put, it. She's put a couple back further south there, John, but. She got away with that. Yeah. That was totally against every botchy rule playing book that is known to man and any other big place. But she got away with it. Yes. And it's still one red. Would Stacey be brave enough to have a crack at the red here, John? Um, I think she's staring it down. I think she's staring it down. She needs the umpire to take control, which is being very loose. At uh, at the very best, our umpire's being very loose. Yeah, yeah, he's been a bit rough around the edges tonight, but... uh, she sits she's, on this. She, she sits on this. Just oh, sitting on it. Oh, oh what a brilliant. shot! She has. She got the two though. She's got the two there. I can guarantee it. Sitting where I am, John. It looks pretty close, my friend. I think he's going to have to get the tape out here. Yeah. He's nodding his head, but he's all, giving it to. He's giving it to Susie. No, Susie is just. Oh, she's waved it away. She's lost all victorage. As I said, uh, Bones at the moment, he's like Stephen Bucknor in the 90s, mate. He was not making very good decisions. And then coming... I'd be checking everything. And then coming back to another one is the Kiwi umpire, which was atrocious at the end, to, end of his career. Oh, well, the bent fingers. Yes. Yeah, well, as I said, if you can't get your fingers straight, there's no way you can do anything. And he calls a six like he wants to go to the toilet. <laughs> now, we do have a, uh, a little bit of a problem with our ref, but uh, I think we'll battle through. These two women are professional. Unlike our ref. You want a drink, John? Now we're going for the short end again, which is great bocce. Um, these girls are putting on a show, and I think that's a great bowl by Stacey. That is uh, A1 class in any grade. Any grade. This looks heavy. This looks heavy. And again, just been showing up Sue Thicket in these shorter ends where Stacey, as Dane alluded to in the preview, which could bring her down somewhat. But again, she's just proven me wrong with a beautiful bowl to take the shot. And that is going to be hard to remove. Stacey has decided to come off the wall and in doing so has left it well short. Takes a lot of pace off it when you use the wall. Didn't waste any time with the second and has paid the price. One red, but her her first ball is still quite good. It's going to be hard to beat. Sue has taken the same route, but I don't think that's going to come out from there. And that'll be one red. In a very, very good uh, first three balls, but uh, fell away very quickly after that. Similar to our umpiring. Yeah, definitely a cause for concern there, the umpiring. Um, when, you, when you start talking about umpires, it's never a good thing, Dane, because you want to be concentrating on the play. And like any sport, if you're concentrating on an umpire, referee, anyone as in officialdom, rather than the actual game, is never good. Never good. Well, no, he has been away for the game for about uh, three months. He was a bit late getting his vaccine done, old uh, Bones. So maybe he's just sort of getting back into his room. But he's umpired three games today, John, so... Yes, yeah, so maybe it's taking his toll, Dane. A um, bit worn out. Oh, possibly. Maybe the concentration no. factor's not there. Um, Maybe a bit too much too early. Possibly, possibly. We do, as I said, we need to reevaluate him when it comes to finals. Yeah, yeah, but let's concentrate so. on the game, Dane. Um, we've got a very close one. Yeah, Susie, Three all. Susie with Kitty back in the hand. And she's going to try and take this to Stacey on the backboard. And that's a great shot. Yep, that's a very good shot. What we call the Stacey shot. And who bore this shot? It is Stacey. Now, what's Stacey doing? A Stacey shot. She's a bit skinny. Ooh. Ooh. As the crowd starts to rock in for this final. Yeah, a bit late. (laughs) 
Yeah. Yes. Yes. Ooh, I think Mother's got the best of her here at the minute. She has. Well, there's that shocking ball. I can't believe she didn't replace that. But that shocking ball has just become an absolute cracker. Absolute cracker. What a ball that is. Yes, yeah, very good there. That is, it's hard to beat there now. Yes. Now, I've just seen the shoulders slump on Sue with a very noticeable sign of that was a bloody good shot. Yeah, you, should, you sort of need to be a little bit more aggressive off the wall on the backboard here, John. Just to try and punch that green or the white out a little bit. And Sue's going direct. Oh, no. No, terrible from Sue here. I don't like it. That's a terrible shot. She needs to really attack that wall. And the umpire, Uncle Bones, has oh, told eventually Susie. he's pointed out what's holding. Yes. I think is, is Sue asking for advice from the umpire, which is totally illegal? It is totally legal. And Susie, a little bit earlier now, but still not aggressive enough, John. She needs to be a little bit harder. Oh, it's oh, going to work. Oh, she's got the Wicker Queen. The Wicker Queen has done it. Oh, maybe two. That is two every day of the week, Dane. That is a fantastic shot. The a little wicker. bit of luck. I don't well, think it was exactly what she wanted to do, but it paid off. The Wicker Queen, we call her, John. And the Wicker Queen has come to the fore. Can she wick herself to another championship? Stacey looking at her in absolute disbelief. Said, How did you get that? I just hope this doesn't get violent. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure it won't go to fisticuffs. No, I think if, if this game was uh, three hours later, maybe. Mm. But not now. Not where we are now. Yeah, it's before fine. sundown. I can see what you're saying, Dane, but uh, I, I really do think if this gets close, uh, coming into the latter stages, there could be some punches thrown. Um, I don't know how the NAPRODAC looks to that. There isn't actually a, uh, a board to go forward and say, you've got matches. No, well, it comes under the uh, NAPRODAC uh, committee board. Yep. And it is still an act of violence in the club, and you will be reprimanded ap appropriately. Depending on the severity of the uh, Depending incident. Depending on the severity. If it's, if it's funny, we'll might let you off. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's get back on the game here. Uh, uh, we digress, but there's still one black here, and uh, Sue is in a little bit of trouble. Yeah, a little bit of trouble. She went round the easy corner, what we call here the mm. left hand corner going down. I think this is going to miss everything here, Dane, if even she does hit yeah, the corner. You're right, John. She's missed the corner. I think this might be. If Stacey's half serious here, she'll stomp her oh, authority. I on think this will be a foot on the throat. Put on the throat here. Foot on the throat. And that's a beautiful ball if it's got the legs. Oh, I don't think the pace is oh, really filling that stone up. she's yeah. carrying. Why she, she got to change that stone ball. Yeah, this is better. Mm. This will be another point. She's got to get inside that. And it does easily. And it's going to be right on it. Fantastic ball from Stacey Thicket. What a ball. She's a, she's a truly wonder, uh, Stacey. She's a fantastic player. Fantastic player. With a fantastic shot there to give her a little... Uh, square um, it up again. Square it up again at 5 all. Don't get the shits, Bones. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Bones was. He was promised a, uh, a swap out in the commentary box, but... He did get sucked in the commentary, so he has been. He actually has been demoted tonight, and he's he's not real happy about it. I don't. I think his whole persona is just totally wrong for the for the position he's in. No, well, he, he looked like he just jumped out of a Ute at Bondi. So, where's his surfboard? Yes, yeah. I'm hearing you. Yeah, yeah, Stacy, she's got to go. Yes, that's a, that's that is yeah. actually a better ball than it looks, Dane. I know from here it's uh, about uh, six hundred mil, but from where Sue sits, it's got to look very awkward. Hence, she's gone. I think she's that's gone skinny. a little bit skinny, and it has come up short. It just gets right in the line of the eye, which makes it a lot harder doing that shot. Um, whereas 
in probably in a three uh, in in on a Wednesday night, that would be probably be hit out. Yeah, absolutely, John. And that's oh. what I'm talking about. It's right in the eye, and hence she's promoted. Almost a rookie mistake for a senior player. Yeah, and I don't think she needs to put the defensive ball down the back. No. She is attacking off the wall, probably a little bit too heavy. Yep, that was ordinary. I can, Stacey is just going to hone in on this if she can. If she can, Still but that is a shocker. It's a bit heavy, a lot heavy, and that is... That's out of here. Actually, Mum's laughing at the door to... This is not bad. This is not bad. In and fact, her, it's the best ball. And her, That's right, John. And her smile quickly turned to a sneer then. It did. I seen Mum having yes. a little laugh yes. at uh, the daughter, mm. but that changed very quickly when she rolled in that second ball. Stacey, full of energy, not so much Mum. She struggles to walk down. Yeah, she'd be pretty disappointed there, Sue. Oh, yes, the, so the shoulders have uh, slumped there, Dane, but... Uh, oh, she is not going away, I can guarantee you that. She will no, not go away. This game is far from over. Far from over, Dane. Going on, a little, uh, going on at a good clip tonight, uh, John. I don't yes, I do, too many... I do quite like it. There's no Joe Sulisic or yeah. Kerry Burrows uh, holding shit up. Um... It is, it is. It's played at a very good pace, Dane. Yep. Oh, both players very sure of themselves, John. Ah, oh, they know exactly how to play this game. Yep. Not bad from Stace, maybe a touch short, but this is where she, she gets the coin, John. Susie off the wall, maybe a touch hard. She needs to take something. Looks heavy. And that'll and go is. away. And this is the little advantage I think that Stacey has in these areas. Just a tad better, but Sue has been good today in adjusting, and I think she's done it here. If it gets past, if it gets past, oh, oh and that was great weight. Just a, not a, not the best line. That hurts. In a close game, that hurts. That could be the difference, John. Almost a turning point there, Dane, and if this doesn't go in. This is heavy. And that is way heavy. That's what I'm talking about. When she, when she gets that little... Uh, that shot that should have been in, and it's not. And we all do it. It can play on you. Oh, and oh, Stacey's, Stacey done? Stacey's absolutely said, what you can do, I can do better, and put it way down the back. Yeah, I think she's adjusted quite well here, but I don't know if this is going to get short. Yeah, it's a sneaker or not. Is it a sneaker? No, it isn't. Oh, and she's let him off the hook. She's let mother off the hook. She's let mother off the hook there. Really unbelievable, yes, and she knows it, even though there's a little grin on her face, Dane. <laughs> She knows she's let him off. Yes. Let her off. That was a, a very easy three points there, Johnny. Oh, that wasn't foot on the throat stuff that we're used to from the no, thickets. No, that's right. Uh, maybe a little bit of sympathy from her mother there. I, don't I know. doubt it. But that that was a that was a crucial moment in the game. But if, I'll tell you what, John, and from here on in, if Sue ends up winning over Stacey tonight, that will be Exhibit A of why she why she got beat. Very good point, Dane, and uh, we'll go through that on the analyzer on Monday night. <laughs> Stacey again, touch hard. Oh yes, that was a very good chance. Coming a little bit often, unstuck. How often do we see it? This is a chance for Sue now to get back into this. Maybe a touch better. Not great. But it's holding. I think uh, you will see a very good bowl here from Stacey. Oh, no, this is a um, come and get me ball. <laughs> the walk <laughs> of shame. The walk of shame from Stacey Thicket. And you watch her put her head down as she has to pick that ball off the court. Walk of shame. Actually, it's absolutely disgraceful. The umpire should have picked that up. I'd normally go to the walk of shame. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you don't need that in a final. No, I'll tell you what, and I mm. said it just before, Johnny. I said if Stacey ends up losing that game, she'll look back on that last end. Mm. Don't go heavy. This is the worst thing you can do is go heavy here. Oh, i tell you what, John, that is going to just hold. Well, well, at least that's in. It's not as bad as it looks, but 
what it is. It was a very good cider for Sue. She only has to aim at that ball and it'll curl in and then, beautifully. And then this is all right. Mm. That is a winner. Now Sue with the momentum, John. Uh, yes. She could claw her way back into this. Weighty, but I think she's in the area. Yeah, that's two. Mm. Two absolutely perfectly executed bowls, Dane. Executed bowls. Again, we're with, they're in a point. Narrows the gap. 8 7. You know, looking here, John, it could have been 10 5, staring down the barrel of game over, and now it's 8 7. And Stacey realises that. But. She's not the player that'll... Uh, she won't dwell on that, Dane. She will not dwell on it. Oh, oh, oh hang on a minute. A bit I of dust you. kicking there. Oh. A bit of dust kicking. Tried to flick it up. And reportable, Dane? Was yeah. it reportable? No, not reportable, but reprimandable. Yep. Keep it fair, ladies. Come on. Oh, yeah, the umpire, and, uh, umpire steps in four hours after it's been done. <laughs> <laughs> He's a little bit late on that call, wasn't he? Yeah, he was a little bit late, you know. Yeah. Was, oh, hang, oh on hang on. Hang on a minute. Was that a... Oh, oh. Sue's bowled a red. I don't know what's going on here, John. I don't understand the frustration. Oh, it was a terrible bowl. Don't. Oh, that, that's okay. But Stacey yelled out, not Sue. I'd like to watch that on the replay. Yes, yeah. Can we get <laughs> Pretty an sure it was Sue. I'll have to see that. I was, I'm not sure what happened then. No, she just wasn't happy with the ball, no. No, it was Stacey yelled out, though. That's what I don't understand. But anyway, no matter. Sue straighten up a little bit, but it's going to go skinny. Oh, it will. That is, that's, I think that's, oh, it's oh, got a nice. Oh, oh, and it rolled back. Buzz's footprint has come into play again after that last Wednesday. He's got a lot to answer for, and that has cost Sue that shot. Kerry Burrows. Uh, the Kerry footprint. Not your carbon footprint, the Kerry footprint. The Kerry footprint. This needs to be good. It looks good. It's in the area. This should come oh, out nicely. Perfect job, Sue. Yeah. The Stacey Thicket shot. Who now should be able to do this blindfolded. Oh, I tell you what, this is aggressive. I like it. Oh, it needs, it, needs, it needs to get a nice week. Oh, didn't. No. You've got nothing off the backboard. Yeah, too far out. She's got gone no. closer. She might take something here. She, no, no, she doesn't want anything, I don't no. think. Don't get anything. She might give away two. Game changer, John. Oh, that is a game changer. That was a terrible shot from Stacey Thicket. I think that's too red. Two red will put Sue Thicket in front. My eye is as good as anyone's, and I'm telling you now, that is two red. Even though Baines is measuring it. That was in easy. That is two red. This game is poised. Another... Two points to red, which is Sue Thicket, which makes her nine. Eight, nine the score. Coming into the closer, closer and probably the worst part of the game for your mind. Can you keep playing? Can you keep mentally uh, stable? And uh, I know these two women have problems with that. But they are champions. Their mental stability will come into it, but they are champions. And that's a terrible bowl. Oh, that's a shocker. As I said, their mental stability will come in. Stacey is almost laughing at this shot. Now, especially straight after you take the lead back. Mm. You want something a lot better than that, John. And look at Stacey. Pull off one of the hardest shots in Bocce. The left-hand side on court three. Yeah, as, it's not as, bad. As, as I'll tell you what, that's a good shot, Dane. I can guarantee you that's a good shot. That is hard to beat. Sue's gone a bit early again, I think, John. Yeah, this ain't going to go anywhere near it. 
I, I know that looks like a fair way away, Dane, but that is a very good bowl from where that kitty is on court three. Well, realistically, Sue should be looking at the right-hand corner here. Maybe a little bit aggressive. Yeah, that red there, Dane? Yeah, I... I, I if it, oh, hang on a minute. Oh, she might she's be getting absolutely, out of trouble here. She got out of trouble big time there. But, but that right-hand corner, John, just to, even if you hit that wicket out, you might fan out. You never know. Yeah, I'm hearing you. Especially on a shot like that, which is very difficult to pull off. Now, this shot is a lot easier. Has she got the legs? I can't believe it. What are you doing, Stacey? This is an easy shot. Yes, very short there. She won't do it again. She's no, too. She's. This is a lot better. Ah, oh, nasty kick, but I think it'll hold. And we're all square again, John. I think it'll and hold. We're all square oh, just. again, just. Oh, what a nail biter we've got here, Dane. An absolute and, and nail Dingo biter. Stepped in the, what is uh, Darren doing on the court? I don't know. Bones must be. Oh, da okay. I don't know. Yes, and actually, I think that's a good change out. Yeah, yeah he looked a bit malnourished there, Bones. Yeah. Uh, umpire Dingo walked he, Did he go for a feed, did he? He's very proud of himself, Dingo. He should be. 96 kilos. 96 kilos, he says. Yes, very good. Did he eat bones? No, maybe. <laughs> 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 he was only 84 before. <laughs> here we go. This could be foot on the throat stuff right here. Yes, very good shot there. And it was all class there. Susie really needs to attack early. Will she go for the hit? Uh, she'll be looking off the wall, I think, here. It's attacking. It's attacking. <laughs> oh, she's got, she's it. got it. What a shot. That is great, Bochy. Fantastic shot from Sue. Under pressure. Bit heavy, Dane? Maybe a touch. Yeah, it's heavy. Yeah. That's better weight. That's better weight. Oh, Johnny, we have not been disappointed here, mate. This is a cracker. That's a beauty. This is a cracker. We have oh. not been disappointed tonight. Worthy of a final, Dane, there is no doubt. Nine all. Susie, two balls left. Can she do something? She needs to play a bowl like she did with that first one. Can she do it? She's gone for the hit. She's oh, just I think this not is early enough. No, unlucky. Neither Will she afford herself another go at that? I can't see why not. There is nothing to worry about. If she can take the white or that black, it's a good shot. Yeah, she's a bit and early she now. Maybe. Oh, hello. Maybe. Hello, boys. It's a goal. Brad oh, Brooks, number 21. And it's one black. Kicked out. And the shoulders slump again. But she'll be back. She will be back. On the next end. There's no way she gives up, old Sue. What did you call her? Old Sue. I didn't say what you said a couple of weeks ago, really get her to the shits, but I thought she was going to smack you that night, John. <laughs> Actually, while we're, on the, while we're on the topic of past performance, John. Yes, Dane. I know you didn't have watch the uh, last week's replay of uh, Kerry and Chook's marvellous victory in the men's doubles, but they yep. did uh, have a couple of sly remarks about you, John. Good. About time they had some shit in their system. Yeah, that's right. They, they had a little bit of mongrel about them, which I didn't quite find fantastic. But well, you were on the receiving end. Yes. At, at one stage there, I think I told uh, Jeffrey they were we were playing against the Serengeti elephant and the uh, South Pacific uh, walrus. <laughs> and I don't think they appreciate it too much, and I think that's why they beat us. And so they got their back up then. Yeah. Oh, yeah. their blubber up. <laughs> 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 Before you get to the back, you get blubber. <laughs> Here we go. Come on, let's get back to this game now. Oh, Dane. look at this. this oh, is that fantastic. is a great ball. This is a Two great, great ball. Bones is fucked off. He's literally in charge. Oh, good. Two great balls there, and uh, responding perfectly was Sue Thicket. And Stacey is come back with a beautiful ball. He's just going to get there. It is. Oh, that's a winner. Oh, that's this is. Girls. I'll well, tell you what, John, you couldn't ask for a better fall than this. This has been spectacular. Fantastic, Dane. What does she do here with this? Oh, no. Oh, she's, she's got a wide one. She was, I think she was caught in two minds whether to punch it. And when you stand over where she is, it is sometimes hard 
to get that right line because it stays straight up. Yeah, and she's got something to do now, Sue. Oh, she needs to block this up. Yeah, so what that, that makes you do this shot? Yeah, yeah, you're right, John. And uh, hasn't she hasn't paid for it badly, so that's still not too bad. But uh, but this could be... Oh, hello. Game, set, match, John. Hello. Stacey, a little grin. Kathy Schuster having a little laugh. They're all having a little laugh. Yes, yes. A little joke up the end oh, for the women. Stacey telling her to hit the bricks, get down the other end. She's not I happy like with stand beyond uh, her. Exactly. And, and she's quite within her rights too. Again, we need to go to the analyzer on Monday yep. and possibly uh, Sue think it could be uh, get matches out of this. Yeah, I can see it. At least get a week, miss the men's doubles. Oh, S Sue will miss the men's doubles. <laughs> <laughs> She'll get a week. Mm. Oh, I can't see her not getting a week. Oh, no. What's happened here? Oh, oh no. It. No. Oh, that's game. No. Oh, there's game day. And that is game. Oh, what a ball. Set and match. Game set match to the youngster in Stacey Thicket has put off a fantastic shot to win the Lady Singles over Mother Sue Thicket. So, Dane, what we thought would uh, pan out did, but only just. We knew it would be a close game. Stacey Thicket just had the edge over the mother. Mother Thicket, I call her. The baby giraffe just couldn't giraffe. pull off those shots that she was during the, in the semis. And the slight favourite one, Dane. Yeah, uh, super surprised. Actually, it was a fantastic game of bocce, I thought, John. It was probably uh, one of the best women's doubles finals I've seen for quite a while. But uh, honestly, John, that was a fair dinkum crack. And both, both of them wanted it. But only one could get it, and it was it was in the end. Stacey just played probably the shorter ends a little bit better than Sue, and I thought that would be the difference in between them. But like uh, maybe you know, Stacey had one big mistake there where she probably let it end go. But lucky enough, it didn't come back to bite her. In your preview, Dane, you mentioned that uh, Stacey would have the better short game. Um, in actual fact, a, a better all-round game, which um, proved to be her strength and eventually got her over the line. Stacey, just, like you said, just had an edge on her with, a, with an all-round game. Sue didn't lay down at any point. She was in it right to the end there. And, um, well, uh, it, was a, it was worthy of a, of a final game. Uh, you can't take any away from Sue's, mate. She's an awesome competitor. She's a great player in her own rights. And, uh, and you know, they've got a fantastic bloodline, the Thickets, too. Right? They're all oh, good players. Oh, great bloodline. You know, and um, just, if I had to say anything, mate, that's just a, that was a cracker of a final, and I'm, I'm glad we filmed that because that was a spectacular final. When I'm looking for my earlier players, and I will, well, I will go to the Thicket bloodline yeah. and uh, pick a couple up in the at the yearling sales. <laughs> um, but... Yes, when you look at Blake now, he's uh, one of the premier uh, uh, yes, men's players. Yeah, you look at even Bo, like the old fella, the old fella in your side, still one of the premier players. I love him coming off first off the side wall. Yeah, great yeah. player, great thinker. Yes, the thickets. Yeah, Bo, as long as you get his nicotine levels up, he's a fucking fantastic player. Yeah. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Thank you, Dane Schuster. And this is uh, wrapping up the uh, singles finals here for the women. Uh, a great final and worthy of a final. Stacey Thicket is the victor. Here we are with Stacey Thicket, the 2021 Women's Singles Champion. Uh, we will be keeping this very brief on Stacey's request. Stacey, fantastic game tonight. Uh, obviously, you played your mother. Two very good players in your own. Uh, how did you see the game tonight? What sort of question is that? Well, how did you feel walking into the game tonight? And oh, easy. Easy? Yeah, very easy? Harder you than weren't it. worried about it? I wasn't worried until I started playing them. Short and sweet, Stace. Yep. Congratulations on winning tonight. Thank you. <laughs>